Okay guys, we're starting this video with another haul. We had to go to Sam's to get my medicine, so we went ahead and grabbed a few things that we needed. We also went to Lowe's and got me some little baby plants. This one is a Pia tree ivy, and that one is a snake plant. So we got those in the little pots. We got pot and soil too, but we didn't bring that inside. So that's what we got from Lowe's. Okay, and we got some cheddar cheese because we need the slices. We only have like two slices left. We got a gallon of milk, some heavy whipping cream. This shrimp, two pounds, was only $5.41. And Jeff said shrimp tacos. So I went ahead and grabbed two. I kind of wish I would have grabbed more than two, but we grabbed two of those, and that will make for Jeff and Noah, it'll make four meals, so that's pretty good. Got some more bread because I'm not baking any this week because I don't really know what's going on this week. Got some hamburger buns, some, did I say heavy whipping cream? If not, there's that. Got some more sun chips, some harvest cheddar. Jeff decided to try these members mark um, wavy potato chips, so we got those. And we got some of this Gardetto, Gardetto's it's kind of like Chex Mix, but it's just a snack mix and my medicine. And we also got some more tissues. And I know I just bought some tissues, but I did not have the amount that I like to have in the house. So I went ahead and got those. They didn't have the big box with the lotion like I really like. So got those. So got all that from Sam's. And I'll be back. For you, it'll be a second. I don't know when it'll be for me. Okay, guys. I'm sitting out on my porch, my front porch. This used to be a beautiful big aloe plant. Now it's got a couple of little ones that's trying their best. And then there's some little baby ones growing up. Oh, there's another one. There's like three little baby ones growing. So I'm gonna let them grow, grow, grow. Hopefully they will take over this pot and maybe I can repot those at some point. I'm thinking that I may go get some more aloe plants because I love my aloes. And I know that one can produce many over time. But just like, I cannot believe I forgot them outside. I just cannot believe it. And honestly, I don't understand why the garlic chives didn't come back. Because all the rest of them did. But this one didn't. I don't know doesn't matter anyway this is the potting soil that we got is stay green potting mix plus fertilizer is for container gardening I don't know if it's for indoor plants or not but Jeff picked it so it doesn't say indoor plants it just says container gardening and it did show like pots so we've used it before for pots like these pots actually actually yeah we've used it and they did quite well so that's what we got. And actually, it was on sale. We didn't know it was on sale until we um, purchased it. Anyway, I got these. They are self-watering plants. This part down here. Oh, there's the tag. That part down there. Put it there so it doesn't get fly, fly away. Put the sticker there. It's where the water goes. Like, from here up. The water, it's like, what am I trying to say? It's to prevent root rot or help prevent root rot. Your plant is not sitting in water all the time. But it does pull it up like it naturally would, I would think. But yeah, we got these. I mean, they're quite a bit bigger. And that's what I wanted. So I'm hoping that this will last a little while. And then I'll up pot them again. But I'm going to open this up and... Should have probably brought a knife out. Alright, there we go. I got it open. Oh, I should have moved the camera first. Hmm. Let me see if I can tilt y'all down. <sighs> I'm in a dilemma. I don't want to touch with the dirt. But I want y'all to see what I'm doing. So, we're going to try this. I don't know. I don't care if my shirt gets dirty. 
I got a little pot here that I'm gonna put soil in there. But yeah, um, I'm just gonna up pot them and take them back in the house. And this soil is so wet, I don't even know if I'll have to, you know, water it or not. Because there's a bunch of water in the pot, the little, the little one that they're already in. So I don't know. I picked the wrong one of these. I should have picked a stronger one. Get the soil in. Maybe you know my hands are already nasty. Why does it matter? All right, I'm gonna get this one in. This is the snake plant. Noah said snake plant. It's a 10 ounce we can grow. It's got this uh, to help get the water but I'm gonna leave that I think that's the kind of pot it is see it's got a little thing in there I'll put that over there with my other ones and I'll put that in there put some soil around it I'm not going to disturb that soil much because the root, I could see it like really close to the um, thing. I think that's a really good size for starting. I'll wipe it all down and everything when I get in the house. Oh, I think something is biting me. Put the little doodad back in it. These are low light plants, and I have said before, I know some of you are new, but, um, and you might not have ever heard me say it, but our house is shaded so much that, like, we don't get a lot of sunlight inside. So, any kind of pot, uh, any kind of plants we have, they have to be low light or we're not going to be able to have them in the house unless we use grow lights or something like that which we can do this one has the roots coming out the bottom i didn't notice that it definitely needed to be up potted look at that how it, the root system is it's got a healthy root system so that's good but I just thought this was an adorable little tree. I'll tell you what it's called in a moment. I think, I don't know if I told y'all. The one is the snake plant. And this is the Pia, P-I-A, Pia, I don't know, Ivy tree. And I don't squish down the dirt or anything, the soil. I let it kind of just sit on there like that. It's so cute. I think it's adorable. And I want to get more plants that are like this, that are low light, that I can have around the house because plants are very good at cleaning your air. And I used to have plants all over my house before we moved here, but they just couldn't handle it because I didn't have, I used to have a lot more light. But anyway, I'm going to see if I can turn off the camera, get Noah to come help me get the camera and bring it inside while I bring these inside. But there's my little plants, my little plant babies. I really like them. I think they're going to be great. I hope that they survive and everything works out for them because... I really want more plants and if this gets big enough I can propagate it I can um, you know have more and more of these and I've learned how to do that now I don't know anything about this one because I just saw it and I thought oh low light yes I'm gonna get it it says it's easy to care for so that's good it's a slow-growing plant so 
There we go. Okay. Um, I'll be back at some point. I don't know when. How am I gonna turn this off? I don't. Ugh, I don't know. Let me find a stick. Is there a stick? No. Hey, that's part of the Christmas stuff. Why is that there? Of course, there's no stick when I need one. Let me use this. Can I use this? Okay, guys. I'm about to start our dinner, which is burgers. And we're going to eat some of those sun chips that I got today. Um, I normally wouldn't put oil in the pan whenever I'm going to do burgers. But I'm going to put a little bit of that. And I'm also, at, in a little bit, I'm probably, not decided for sure yet, probably going to add some water. But the reason why I'm adding the oil is because I'm going to be adding some of this onion soup mix. I have a little bit left in here. And I'm also going to add um, that beefy onion soup mix that I made the other day. I'm going to add some of it because we're making um, like copycat crystal burgers, but they're like regular size burgers, not let me shake that up a little bit. Not like the small ones. We're just going to have them regular size. But anyways, we don't know how it's going to taste with this because we've never tried it because I've never had it until I made it the other day. These are not quite thawed out yet. But they're close enough. And I have seven here that I'm going to put in the pan. I'm cooking extra just in case Jeff needs them for work. The pan is on, but I don't um, have it on real high yet, or I may not turn it on high at all. But um, I don't want it to burn that onion and stuff. I'm hoping I can get all seven in this big old pan. I'm pretty sure I can. Yeah, I know I can. thought I could, but you know, sometimes you don't know. This is that big 15 inch skillet. It better fits. Wash my hands. But yeah, this is another simple meal. This is number 101 of the Eat at Home. Like I said, may or may not keep doing it. We'll see. At this point, I don't have any plans to stop yet. <laughs> so that I can put a little bit of this on the top of these. So I can have a little bit of that flavor on the top, on the, all of it anyway. And like I said, it's going to be too many burgers. I'll eat one. Noah said he's going to eat one. And then um, there'll be five left, but Noah might want one later. Jeff will eat one whenever he gets home from work tonight, most likely. And then he'll have something for work. I'm done with that, so it doesn't matter that I'm touching that with the spoon. But um, he'll have something whenever he gets home from work tonight. And then he'll have something for work tomorrow for lunch. Or, well, dinner. Well, some people call lunch dinner. But whatever that time of day whenever he eats while he's at work. So it's really not his lunch, it's really his supper time. But I'm looking at that and I'm thinking I am going to go ahead and add some water. So let me go ahead and get some of that. I'll give me a bowl up here. I don't want to pour it on top because I don't want to 
um, well, I still poured on top of that one a little bit. Anyway, I don't want to, like, wash the seasoning off. That would be crazy. Alright. But anyway, I'm just going to cook these up. Jeff's going to have one for supper tonight, whenever he gets home. He's going to have some for work. If Noah wants one, he can have it later. And we'll end up with two extras. Because most likely Noah will eat two and Jeff will eat two. I'll eat one and then we'll have two extras for whatever. Jeff may eat it for work another night. Noah might eat it. We don't know. Okay, so I have flipped them a couple of times. I'm getting the tea ready to go too, so y'all might hear the kettle. But anyway, um, this video is not going to be much today because I've not been in, like, I've been okay, but um, Judy told me about the funeral arrangements today, and I've just, I've been sad. Plain and simple. Um, but I'm okay. But, and I just didn't want to get in front of the camera. But while that I wasn't there, <laughs> I did some other things. I got the kitchen, cleaned up some things that need to be done. Noah emptied the dishwasher. I reloaded it. Noah bathed the dogs. I helped some. Um, I washed my pad for my, um, my mouse pad or my desk pad for my desk. Uh, what do they call those things? I can't think. Blotters? I don't know. It's actually a gamer mouse or gaming mouse pad or whatever. But anyway, it's huge. I washed that. I don't know what else I did, but i just been doing stuff and I just I made the bed because Jeff didn't. <laughs> but I just didn't feel like filming or doing anything that I was going to be filming. And I don't, there was nothing really for me to film. I do need to do some prep stuff with some fruits and vegetables, but I just didn't want to do it. And it's okay that I didn't. So, I mean, sometimes you just don't want to. And I had thought yesterday that my videos were going to be back to normal and everything, but that just just give me some time, y'all, because I don't know. I thought things differently yesterday than I do today, but I'm fine. Um, and I mean, there's nothing that's wrong with me. Like, how do I explain it? I'm okay. Let's just say that, and I'm going to shut up. Like I said, this is nothing about me. None of this is about me. But I guess it's normal for an aunt to grieve and a sister to grieve for her sister and what she's going through. And for her niece and nephews and her brother-in-law, you know? That's normal. I'm not doing anything abnormal. I just have a platform where I talk to people. But as I said, it's not about me. It's about them. And um, so we have the... We know when the memorial is going to be and everything, um, and where and all that stuff. Of course, I wouldn't share it on here, but <laughs> anyway, uh, we know all that. And it affected me in a way that, I mean, I knew it was coming, and I actually started to ask about it, but I didn't want to be pushy. You know, or anything like that. And I wasn't even sure if they were going to have a memorial. Like, I thought they were, but I wasn't sure, sure. So, you know, I didn't want to be pushy about that. But, I'm okay. So, let's go on to another subject. The burgers are pretty close to done. And I won't be doing anything after this other than showering and editing, editing this video. So like I said, this video is going to be smaller. A tiny sales haul. Me up potting some plants that I'm very happy about. Noah and I both agreed that they look bigger now in the bigger pots than they did in the little pots. 
and I'm kind of wishing that I would have gotten a bigger pot than what I did get, but that's okay. I can always get another one later, and if I'm able to propagate either those or some more of those that's in the window, because I propagated those, I don't know what kind of plant that is. I can't remember the name of it, but it's just that green leaves. Just, you know. I did those. I did, from one of my plants, I did two more. And then my other little plant that's behind the recliner or behind the table, I bought it. It was on clearance at Lowe's last year, and it was one of those that was almost dead. I didn't think it was going to live for a little while, but it's doing okay. It's not growing fast, but that's okay. I don't think any of them will grow very fast in our dark house, but yeah. But we're going to just eat the burgers. I'm not going to like show you the burgers after they're made or whatever. Just know that it's going to be hamburger buns, lettuce. I don't know if Noel wants tomato or not. I don't think he usually does want lettuce even whenever we do this. I think he just eats cheese and mustard. And that's probably what I'm going to do too. But anyway, we're just going to eat these and um, sun chips. And that'll be it. They're not done yet, but they're very close. He's taking a shower because of bathing the dogs and everything. I just helped dry them. I didn't really do anything else. I only helped dry one, really. Because he only asked me to do one. I didn't know he wanted my help. <laughs> I really probably didn't need to put the oil in this either because it's got plenty of its own. But that's alright too. I love the onion in this. I, like, I put the onion on my burger too. Because it's just so good. Just so yummy from the soup mix. But yeah, now my ears are itching. But yeah, today's video was a little bit shorter than I expected. I expected to be doing other things, but honestly, I just didn't feel like it. I did do like I put some clothes in the dryer because that I had washed them and they weren't they didn't spin out right. What is my ear itching for? Oh my goodness. They didn't spin out right, so I don't know. I just re-spun them and then put them in the dryer. They did fine. I think they just got off balance. So, and I did make a treat this week, but I made it yesterday while that Jeff was still home. I just made, he wanted a Rice Krispie treat, so that's what I made. Um, I want to make something else, and I've got to figure out how I'm going to do it. Jeff really likes these Reese's, or he used to, Reese's Cupcakes. Why are you screaming at me? Oh, I know why. Her food's up because the dogs are in the house. Anyway, I'll put it down just a second. She's not starving. But, um, the Reese's Cupcakes, I want to see if I can replicate that. I don't really want to look for a recipe for it. I just want to kind of come up with my own and see what I can do. I mean, I may have to find a chocolate, um, cake recipe or something. I don't know yet. I'm, I'm, I want to try to make them from scratch anyway. And see if I can make some Reese's cupcakes. Not today though. I don't know when I'm going to do it. It's just something I'm trying to figure out how to do because the Reese's cupcakes have this, the same icing that's on the, on the top is on the inside of them is what Jeff said. So. Except it seems like the icing that's on the top is a little bit harder, like, than the what's inside. But, I figure it dries more if it's on the outside than it does if it's inside that cake. But anyway, I'm going to move the camera down here so y'all can see the burgers. And that's what they look like. And I guess I'm just going to go because that's the burgers, that's our supper, and sun chips, the cheddar sun chips y'all saw earlier. But I'm going to go, that's what Noah chose to have. 
I'm going to go because um, there's nothing else I'm going to be doing other than we're going to eat. I'll go ahead and put, turn that off. And um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. And uh, maybe tomorrow's video will be longer. I don't know. I mean, I had a two-hour video last week. What was up with that? Then I, I've had short ones. But uh, during this time right now, just give me some grace and let me see how it's going to go. Because I honestly thought that today's video was going to be pretty full. And it may be longer than I think it is. I don't know. Sometimes they are. Sometimes I won't stop running my mouth like right now. But I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for hanging out with me today. I am okay. Um, keep my sister and her family in your prayers. Um, don't know of anything else that I needed to tell y'all. I don't think. <laughs> but thank you for hanging out with me. I do appreciate it. If you like this video, go ahead and do all the YouTube things. If you didn't like it, do them anyway. You might like something I do later. You never know. There just might be something that you enjoy that comes from this crazy deal. <laughs> Most importantly, leave me a comment down below. Let me know how you're doing because I really do want to know. And remember, don't take any wooden nickels and be sweet.